What's up everybody, CHM Carnivores here, and I could not be more excited about today's video. So I was thinking, um, I share a lot about how to grow Nepenthes, how to grow different types of carnivorous plants, but I don't really share a lot about where I get them and what could potentially be a great resource for you. So in today's video, I'm gonna cover companies from the very, very largest to the very, very small companies that are on eBay, Etsy, so mom and pop stores, all the way to companies that you can uh, get plants for that are very, very reputable. I'm super excited about this. I'm gonna try to keep the video as short as possible. And a bonus, I'm gonna try to show you some of the plants that I've gotten from these places. So that way you get kind of an idea what you're gonna get. All that and more coming your way. See you in just a minute. So stated uh, in the opening, I am so very excited about this video. I don't know why I haven't thought about this sooner to share with you different uh, places where I've got these plants and where you too could pick up some good plants. Uh, so first thing I wanna show is this absolute beauty. Now, this comes from predatory plants. Unfortunately, it is no longer available to them, but the reason why I'm showing you, and you're probably thinking, why are you showing it if it's not available, is this is a mixture of Titan. Now, this comes from predatory plants, um, Titan is an absolutely enormous female truncata that they use on a lot of their hybridization. Um, it will render enormous, beautiful plants no matter what the hybrid is. They have a lot of choices. They do a lot of in-house hybridization, and that is their main staple plant. And so um, you can get these plants. They also are very, very reasonably priced. The Titan um, truncata or Titan's Tower, uh, which is this big big guy or girl hasn't flowered yet for me uh actually came from there as well and i think it was like 25 dollars or maybe even less than that and that is an insane price for a truncata um it may be 40 dollars now i don't know but um extremely extremely affordable and their hybrids for the most part i've only had one or two but I, I mean what do you expect i've bought i've bought i don't even know how many i've only had one or two that gave me issues for the most part their plants are rock solid and have been a, a great great um, option or excuse me purchase for me so let's look at the next grower so the next one is carnivero carnivero is an absolutely wonderful resource um, i've used them quite a bit as a matter of fact brutus back there came from carnivero um, and uh, this patient by Truncata, uh, JB by patient, it also came from there. And then this big one right here is JB by, uh, I want to say Truncata C. Um, but they have an amazing array of plants. They do all, um, a lot of, most of their inventory is hybrid, hybridization. They do in-house. Absolutely amazing, amazing plants. Um, they also have a number of other things in there. So the seeds that you have watched me grow, uh, they come from Carnivero too. Very, very reasonable, reasonably priced. Uh, they can go all the way from $20, $15, up to $200, $300, whatever you're wanting to spend. But awesome, awesome, awesome company. They have their own grow lights that they have. Um, there's just a lot to, to look at. And if you're not into carnivorous plants, they have anthuriums um, and also other kinds of plants, but highly, highly recommend them. So let's look at the next grower. So I'm going to take a wide angle on this one because I got a lot of plants from this company. Uh, this person, this is on eBay, Todd's Tropicals. I could not recommend Todd more. Uh, he does not have a business other than on eBay, um, but rest assured, he is very reputable and the stuff that you get from him are going to be amazing. A lot of these plants, this Diariana is from him. This Hamakua by uh, Caesar is from him, I believe. Uh, not. It maybe it's that Caesar, maybe it's Truncata. Yeah, Hamakua by Truncata is him. Um, these uh, Bongzo by uh, Ventricosa by Merliana is from him. And so I have purchased a ton of plants, Bioc and Truncata. I mean, the list goes on and on. Absolutely amazing grower. Uh, and I highly, highly recommend Todd to anybody that is able to purchase within his area. Um, very amazing. Plants are always extremely healthy very vigorous and so i recommend him next up we have california carnivores and uh, they do a lot more than just nepenthes that's absolutely for sure they have vent, um, venus fly traps drosera uh, just everything you can really think of um, bromeliads that are carnivorous uh, you name it but uh, this is a sanguinea i got from him and i think it was like 20 bucks and it had two plants in it so um, i highly rec recommend them they are super super uh, friendly, very, very helpful. 
uh, very responsive in there uh, when you write them. And so um, they do an amazing job. The other cool benefit with them, especially if you get a Drusera or a Venus flytrap or a Saracenia, is a lot of times they have companion plants in them and that's always really neat uh, because who doesn't like free plants? So highly recommend them. Uh, I'm gonna take us over now to the sundew tent and talk about that along with some utricularia. Now, what I wanna talk about next is utricularia. And so these I get from somebody on Etsy at Avant Garden, and I highly, highly recommend them if you wanna get into utricularia. I think utricularia are extremely underrated as a carnivorous plant. They're some of the coolest in carnivory. They have the fastest traps in the plant kingdom, and they also have the most complex traps in the plant kingdom. And so if you, the, the downside is you can't see the traps for most of them unless you do like a aquatic one uh, and some longifolia you can and they have some magna that's got some big traps but the beauty also is in the flowers and so i've got one growing here uh, this is uh, sandersonii uh, angry bunny but this right here in the middle of your screen is a longifolia bonsai form with a pink fat flower very rare that's the other cool thing about advent uh, garden is that uh, she has a lot of very rare utricularias and so uh, once they bloom i can't wait to show you i've got fusca in here and betty's bay there's so many different things and once they bloom they're absolutely amazing and it's just so cool and so insidious to know that these beautiful plants on the top surface underneath are uh quite quite deadly so let's go on to the next company so the first company i'm going to talk about when we're talking about sundews is carnivorous plant nursery um they are absolutely amazing very very friendly they have certainly way more than just sundews they have utricularia they have nepenthes uh, they have uh, water wheels everything uh, pretty much runs the gamut they have aquatic utricularias very very helpful very friendly and their plants are extremely healthy and yet an another cool thing about them is uh, whenever you get a plant it usually comes with a companion plants that are in them which is absolutely amazing um, highly recommend them uh, they're uh, just absolute all around fantastic, which brings me to the next company that I'm sure you guys have all heard about. So the next one is a big hitter. It is Saracenia Northwest. And so they have a lot of really cool plants. Not only that, but they do a lot to bring a lot of resources to uh, the carnivorous plant community and help out. They have newsletters that you can sign up for. And so that is really, really cool. Um, they, in particular, I have found do an amazing, they don't do it on purpose, but Every plant that I get from them comes with just dozens of other plants. You, you put it in your, uh, your uh, little space here and then give it a, a couple days to a week, maybe a couple weeks, and then you have all these little unknown plants popping up. And so it's kind of like a cool uh, you know, game, kind of like Christmas morning. You don't know what you're going to get. Uh, you think you're getting one plant, and all of a sudden you've got all these tiny little babies. And so that is really, uh, for me at least, and I'm sure for everybody, very very enjoyable they also are extremely helpful um and here's a really cool fact for them and i, I i'm probably uh, i'm going to share this with you this does it's not known by a lot of people you can sign up for their newsletter and then sign up with them uh you have to go in every month to win a uh a giveaway and they will it's usually a hundred dollar store credit each month and so that is pretty amazing so each month they get a store credit uh, out to one lucky customer who signed up for that newsletter. And I mean, how cool is that? Yet again, more free plants. So you just go to their website and then sign up for the newsletter and sign up for that drawing each month. And that's pretty freaking exciting. I just recently myself found out about it. It is a pretty well-known uh, little hidden gem of a secret. So you're welcome. All right, so the last company that I'm gonna to refer to is Hydroculture. Hydroculture is through Etsy as well. She is absolutely amazing, extremely helpful. All the plants that I've gotten from her have been ridiculously healthy. I mean, these are some of the healthiest plants that I have seen. She uh, helps out a lot with the International Car uh, Carnivorous Plant Society, uh, knows her stuff for sure. And so these plants that I've gotten have all been extremely healthy, have taken very well to uh, the trip the trip and the transfer, everything's been very well packed. Uh, I could not recommend uh, uh, her enough. Absolutely amazing. Um, they There is quite a lot of variety on there, but there's always more coming up. And so the Drosera is something they have on there. I've also gotten some Utricularia from her. And so I will continuing uh, continue to be buying more as I've had nothing but great um, success with uh, the plants that she's provided and they have all been extremely strong. So 
uh, yep, let's, uh, let's turn the camera around and wrap up the video. Well, I hope that you liked that really quick tour. I wanted to make a short video uh, and I don't want to just spend forever talking about these companies, but I can tell you that uh, this is certainly not an exhaustive list. Exhaustive list. There are certainly a ton of different companies out there that I did not mention. Pearl River Exotics, uh, Pet Fly Traps, a lot, of, a lot of those. I haven't personally used them, so I can't speak on them, but I've heard great things about them. I just wanted to touch on the ones that I've experienced. I also want to touch on the fact that whenever you're doing uh, research or buying plants, make sure that you do a very good job of finding out the background of these companies. Now, some of the larger, more repu reputable ones are great, and so they're great to purchase from, and you know that you're not getting any poached plants, and they're fantastic. But there are a lot of mom and pop out there and a lot of smaller companies that also produce amazing, amazing plants, and they do it responsibly. And so I named some of those today that I've been very, very happy with and will continue to purchase from in the future. Now, if you have any questions or any concerns, or if you'd like to uh, add in any feedback that you've gotten from these companies or any other companies uh, that is not mentioned in this video, please don't, uh, don't hesitate to comment. As always, uh, thank you so much. Um, Look forward to speaking with you again. I hope you, I hope you have a wonderful uh, day and a wonderful week, and uh, I'll see you soon.